PSG.
He going, bro. Yeah, he might not be going. Bro, this a lick. Awesome opportunity. Today we did our first Friday night football game. First, I just want to say I'm extremely proud of Faith Academy and Golf Show. Both of these, both of these programs show it's extremely great sportsmanship, hard work, and dedication. And I'm just glad Friday night football is back, man. Anything you'd like to say, bro? Man, we lost this one, but we're going to come out next. we competitive, hard work, and get better at practice, bro. We got to play the team, get it right, and get it done. All right. And as a leader, um, just tell me, how did you still keep your team uh, uplifted, even though y'all, you know, do the uh, opportunities that the golf shows took advantage of? How did you keep yourself, you know, keep that composure? Put it behind us and motivate ourselves to strive for more, I was just saying. Oh, yeah. And I just want to tell you, man, like, I want to not just tell you, but your whole team, I'm still proud of y'all. Keep y'all head up. Y'all got mo y'all got a whole season ahead of y'all. Keep it just encouraging each other. From the scout team to the varsity players, y'all all need each other. Even the water ball is all y'all play a huge part. And tonight, I saw how you, all y'all, like, you know, it took a little minute for y'all to get that energy, but y'all finally came together. Y'all start taking, uh, you know, advantage of those opportunities. And I will be back. So, uh, is there anything, any um, motivation you'd like to get anybody else around the community? Man, keep your hard work up. Don't stop. Stay focused and get to school first, I said. Oh, yeah. I'm the Wool Games TV. Man, I just want to give a huge shot golf for this awesome opportunity. Today we got four great young men from um, Golf Shores. I just want to say I'm extremely proud of these young men. We just got a few questions for these young men. Uh, first, we talk about like, how do y'all mentally keep up with the golf I mean, really just coach parents every day, every week, you know what I'm saying? And we always eat food, always grinding, eating out food, always stay hydrated. Wherever we go, we got a bar and water, we just stay hydrated, you know? And we just, they take, we take breaks on defense, on offense, and we just do our little thing. Yeah, and it just, it goes beyond, you know, just in school, you know, go home, stretch it, eat right, and stuff like that. On top of that, we got some of the best trainers in the state, and they all make sure we do it. Yeah, I'll finish up the our coaches make sure we're rested um, and well-fed in the morning we have breakfast and, and we, we, we just make sure we're well-fed and rested. And then another question I'd like to ask, um, just tell me about y'all support system. When it comes to your mental health, staying balanced, like y'all have so much going on, being in school, football practice, like how do y'all stay mentally balanced? Uh, we, we actually have a lot of resources. Um, one of our, one of our uh, teachers, uh, is really close to every single one of our teammates, and uh, she makes sure we're all good academically, uh, mentally, and physically. Uh, she gives us pedialites um, to make sure we're not cramping in the game. Uh, if you guys want to. Yeah, we got a uh, life coach. Yeah, we got a uh, life coach, Pastor Frank. He's a pastor at the Island Church. He comes in every practice. He just uh, talks to us. He prays with us. And every, every, uh, before every game, before we have our pregame, he comes in and gives us a little 15 minutes in the sermon. And that just keeps us all going. I'm just so proud. Uh, with Keisha, I'm going to pick back over with Keisha's there. Um, Pastor Franks, he, he comes to us all the time. He just shows up out of nowhere. And he, being around him is a, lot of, is a lot of fun. He brings the energy. He brings the juice. You know, so we're not just we're not just good mentally, physically. We're good spiritually, you know. So I really, I really, we really appreciate, like, appreciate him just coming in and helping our guys up and helping us trying to find God. On top of all of that, you know, we all got each other. We step on this field and struggle about that. And uh, just, I just got a few more things to say. Uh, I just love the unity because, you know, like you say, when it comes to being a student athlete, you want to have teammates who support you mentally, you know, physically, uh, all that, and spiritually the most. And that's just a blessing just seeing that as well, uh, which asks, leads me to my last question. What advice you would like to give to the community, to other student athletes that may be struggling mentally, you know, or spiritual or academic? So, basically, I, I, I take guys all the time, you know, it's just, it's just a mindset thing. You, you just gotta get your mind right. Get away from all the, get away from all the uh, distractions and stuff like that. You know, just the females, the gangs, and everything like that. Just you just gotta dig in. You just gotta dig a hole, piece yourself in that hole, and stay in that hole for a little bit so you can, you know, get yourself together. You know. You know, you gotta do, you know, talk to the trusted adults and like that. Like, no, really, what helped me is just praying. Just going to church, talk with your family and stuff like that. 
Just talk, talking to God. That, that's all I can say. <laughs> yeah. It's just, it's really just a mindset thing, for real. They ain't talking to God. That really, that really helps. You know, it's just, it just really helps to find the find Jesus, find Jesus, find God. You know what I'm saying? You get right with Him, ain't nothing go go wrong. You might you might be down one day, but God go wake you up the next morning and tell you, hey, let's get up, let's get this start today. And, you know, that's just the end of my question. I just want to say I'm extremely proud of each and every one of these young men that stepped on this field tonight from Faith Academy to Gulf Shores. All these young men are doing extremely great when it comes to community, not only as, uh, you know, athletes, but as students as well. And we just got to appreciate them and continue to just motivate them to be the best individuals they can be. And I just want to thank God for this opportunity just to put them on my platform. I want to thank this young man as well, too, bro. Y'all also follow his uh, platform as well. We just trying to bring more exposure to our athletes and just showing the right way what it what the true definition of student athlete. So thank y'all so much to Wu Gang TV.